I'm Dr. Gifford Jones. So I'm here tonight to give people the second opinion about how to treat coronary artery disease, namely with high doses of the vitamin C and lysine. As the old uh, cartoon strip said, uh, it was Pogo, Pogo, who said, we, we've identified the enemy and the enemy is us. In other words, we're the architects of our own misfortune. Years ago when I interviewed Linus Pauling, the one thing he told me initially was that animals have always made vitamin C and, and humans don't. And it was his, his uh, feeling that uh, because of that fact that uh, we were having the epidemic of coronary artery and cardiovascular disease. The reason being that vitamin C is needed for the production of collagen, which is a necessary component that holds that holds coronary cells and other cells together. In other words, it's the glue that holds cells together. And when you don't have enough vitamin C, you have inadequate co collagen. And that's where a crack occurs in the, between the coronary cells and a blood clot occurs. So that, that story has always rang a bell with me. So I've always, for the last 16 years, taken high doses of vitamin C and lysine. I've developed an interest in natural remedies, particularly vitamin C, and uh, that, that has been my, my primary interest, that uh, people are needlessly dying of coronary attacks because they're not, they're not taking enough vitamin C and, and, and lysine. And we now have evidence with a Dr. Bush in England who has shown that if you take these high doses and you take a, a picture of the back part of the eye, the retina, beforehand and after. In other words, you take a picture of the retina one year earlier, and then after they've been on vitamin C and lysine, high doses, you take another photo a year later, you can actually see hardening of the arteries, namely atherosclerosis gradually fading away. And that is a revolutionary, monumental discovery, and it should be the headlines of every newspaper in the world, but isn't. Many C. Uh, it's a high com combination of vitamin C and lysine. Uh, I take three scoops a day, which means I take 2,000 milligrams each scoop and 1,300 milligrams of, of, uh, of uh, lysine. And I take one of those scoops three times a day, breakfast, lunch, and the evening meal. So I'm taking a total of 6,000 milligrams of vitamin C a day and 3,900 milligrams of lysine. That dosage you can not only prevent but you can reverse atherosclerotic lesions in coronary arteries. They're effective and they have no unintended consequences compared to cholesterol-lowering drugs.